This is our new mattress. <laughs> it might not look like a mattress just yet, but 30 years ago, two brothers, one of which was a rocket scientist, invented a new material that was specifically designed for medical beds and seat cushions for wheelchairs. A wheelchair user is sitting all the time, so if the cushion is too hard, it can start to damage the skin. Today, those same two brothers have taken that material and are making entire beds out of it. Today's video is sponsored by Purple. We're going to see how they've taken that super soft cushion technology and are manufacturing entire beds. It should be pretty interesting. Let's get started. We're here inside the Purple Mattress Factory, and this place is so large, seven football fields can fit inside of it. Right behind us right now are all the finished mattresses, but today we're gonna see how the mattresses are constructed and what makes them different than everybody else. So this purple dust is one of the secret ingredients that starts building the hyperelastic polymer that purple uses in their mattresses. It feels like kinetic sand and powdered sugar had a baby and it's the purple powder. The powdered mixture gets melted down and gets melted into a massive injection molding machine, which pumps out the massive sheets of purple grid like you see here. These are then cut down into the specific mattress sizes. You know twin, queen, king, and California king. All the excess is added to these bins and then ground up and preserved to be used again later. A super cool part of this whole operation is that any portion of the purple mattress that they don't use, you know, the hyperelastic polymer part, they can just grind up and reuse in future mattresses. So there's zero waste involved. So we've seen how the top of the purple mattress is made. In order to combine that top with the hybrid base, the coils in the base are sent through a machine that adds adhesive to the top layer. That adhesive is then cooked through a red hot conveyor belt oven and then foam borders are set around the outside of the mattress on the top, where the purple hyperelastic polymer can then ride up a conveyor belt and plop down very satisfyingly inside. Spreading out to each edge in every corner. After the purple grid is all spread out, the machine goes into a giant smasher, which smashes the purple into the bottom layer and creates a solid bond. After the mattresses have been smushed and adhered, they slide down the rest of the rollers, dry off, and get packaged up. Once the hybrid mattresses are sufficiently dry, we can add the fire sock, which covers the entire mattress and then is pinched off and sewn shut. The final cover is then added, and the whole mattress is flipped over onto the backside to help facilitate the cover closing. Once the bottom is closed up, and the mattress tag is added, the whole thing moves into a giant suction machine. To facilitate the shipping, the mattresses are then pressed into a giant compressor, which vacuums all the air out and turns it into a giant purple pancake. The purple pancake is then rolled up into a giant purple burrito and then eject it into a giant purple sleeve. My favorite part of this whole contraption is this giant suction machine right here, which can lift up 240 pounds. Since these mattresses are pretty heavy, it has three suction cups on the end <laughs> and effortlessly places the mattress onto giant pallets so they can be shipped out. So Cambry, now that you've seen how the mattresses are made and put together, are you ready to go try ours out? Yeah, I'm excited to try it out because I've seen how much work goes into it now. They look pretty cool from the inside, which we know is the best. Let's go. So there are a lot of mattress in a box companies out there, but Purple is different. That same grid that was used for wheelchair cushions is now the size of a bed and used for entire bodies. It was super fun seeing how Purple can cram a massive mattress into such a small footprint for shipping. The pros of having a Purple grid system over foam is that it can dynamically adapt to your body, no matter what your sleep position is or what body type you have. It smushes down where it needs to, but then remains supportive for the rest of you. 
and if someone moves on one side of the bed, it doesn't disturb the other side of the bed. The purple grid system also allows for airflow, so the bed stays cool. What started out as high-end medical mattresses and wheelchair cushions 30 years ago is now available to the general public, and we're excited to try it out. So one thing Camber and I decided to go with was the power base for the purple bed, and that's because the whole thing has motors in it. It can raise the feet and the head. One thing that I don't think Purple really thought about was that the base is also adjustable. So we have the height set to a perfect height for Cambry so she can transfer in and out of the bed fairly easily. There's a couple different thicknesses that you can get on your mattress and we ended up going with the three because it's not super firm and not super fluffy. It's kind of got that Goldilocks effect. It's kind of that perfect middle ground between the soft and the hard. If you use the link in the video description right below this video, you can try out a purple mattress for 100 days. And if you don't like it, purple will come, take away the mattress for free, and give you a full refund. Plus, there's a 10-year warranty on them. We're pretty excited to try it out. Huge thanks to Purple for sponsoring this video. I really do enjoy seeing how everything is made. I feel like we're Mr. Rogers. We just went to one of those factories to show all the kids. <laughs> right. It really is, though. And, uh, yeah. The link is down in the description. We'll see you around. There we go. Thanks a ton for watching. Uh. We'll see you around.